It's the PFG Rock and Roll Talk Show, Scorch TV, Fridays at 12.30 a.m. on WMFP, Channel 62, Retro TV in Boston. Yo, I did everything that I could, Dave. I don't get... I didn't say that! Who lost the match? Who took the fall? Yo! Yo where were you? I was where there. Where were you? I didn't see you anywhere. I didn't see you anywhere. You lost no. the match! I didn't see you anywhere. No, we played. Where were you? Brandon Lott, Mr. Championship. Hold on just one second. First of all, I don't appreciate the fact that you're in here in the locker room with the camera going, all right? We have a little misunderstanding that's happening right now, but I'm gonna go and take care of it. Brandon Locke is a tremendous talent, but he doesn't have his head screwed on straight. I'm gonna take care of it. Now why don't you go take that camera and find something more productive to do in this locker room. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages, fans of all ages, feast your eyes on Elia's greatest prize, Mr. Fabulous Tony Ulysses. Yes, Eli, I am your prize, and I'm going to take you under my wing and simply make you fabulous. <laughs> I'm going to take you to places that only you and I can dream of all the way to the top. And let me tell you one thing, ladies and gentlemen, it will simply be fabulous. From Centauri, Greece, weighing in at 180 pounds, he is the ambiguous assassin. in the crown of Mr. Fabulous Tony Ulysses, the ambiguous assassin Ilya Markopoulos, as we're going to take our first look at him on the NECW Online Update. And speaking of first looks, a debut of another impressive newcomer. Alfonso making his NECW debut as we take you back to action that took place in Abington, Massachusetts. Vouch for the Scouts. I want to send a big shout out to everyone involved with Abington Cub Scout Pack 11, Abington High School, and everyone who helped make this event a gigantic success. We see Mr. Fabulous taking a little bit of a hissy fit. Alfonso showing off the goods. The fans in Abington, much to their delight and approval. Watch, watch, my guys flex. Watch. Now show them. Oh! Markopoulos not getting quite the same reaction. Although let's take nothing away from Markopoulos as an athlete. Can you dig that? Can you dig that? Can you dig that? Says Tony Ulysses. Delfonso easily winning the popularity contest, and we'll have more highlights from this matchup when we continue after these words. NECW Sonic Boom. The audio podcast with Al Basler and Chris Norman. Now online at NECWWrestling.com. Back to action here. Delfonso chasing Markropolis around the ring. Markopoulos seemingly wanting no part of Tony Delfonso. Delfonso now back to the outside, giving chase. Referee Rob Tuttle counting both men. Mr. Fabulous now grabs the leg of Delfonso and Markopoulos with a big super kick right in the temple. What about what we saw at the top of this update? Dissension between the real deal Brandon Locke and the dynasty. Al Basler of NECW Sonic Boom is going to try to get some words from the real deal. After this, Mr. Fabulous getting involved on the outside, clubbing Tony Delfonso right across the head. 
And Markropoulos now with a big forearm. Markropoulos. Irish whip reverse. Alfonso levels it with a clothesline. Back elbow. Listen to this crowd. Markropoulos upstairs and down. Mr. Fabulous now up on the ring apron. And Markropoulos to the outside. A little later in the match, once again, Mr. Fabulous up on the ring apron trying to distract Alfonso. Markropoulos from behind. Another super kick right under the chin. Markropoulos reveling in self-satisfaction. And folks, don't forget, Saturday night, December 10th, New England Championship Wrestling, returning to Carver High School. NECW Unwrapped. That is one you don't want to miss. More details coming up a little bit later. And Delfonso coming back now on Markropoulos. Delfonso unloading. Markropoulos for the rake to the eye. Mark Ropolis demonstrating some of the veteran tactics of Tony Ulysses and a standing drop kick. Mark Ropolis uh, maybe pointing to the fairies there, not quite sure about that. But folks, don't forget Saturday night, December 10th, NECW unwrapped as we return to Carver High School in Carver, Massachusetts. And a big boot to the face of Ilya Mark Ropolis. Full body slam by Delfonso. Irish whip to the corner. Delfonso, big power slam. Once again, fabulous up on the apron. Delfonso now sees him, takes a swing. Locked up by Fabulous, but Markopoulos nails his own man. Markopoulos totally thrown by this turn of events. And Delfonso laying in wait. Bear hug by Delfonso. He's got him locked in. The massive arms of Delfonso. Crushing the rib cage of Ilya Markopoulos. Shades of Bruno San Martino. And that's going to do it. A very impressive victory for Tony Delfonso this week on the NECW Online Update. And it's back to the drawing board for Fabulous and Markropolis. I'm sure we have not seen the last of them. Once again, your victor, Tony Delfonso. As we'll have more of this NECW Online Update as we continue after this. NECW Live, Saturday night, December 10th at Carver High School, 60 South Meadow Road, Carver, Mass., with a 7 p.m. bell time. Proceeds benefit the Carver High School hockey program. The main event is a special six-man Champions Challenge tag team match. As the NECW tag team champions, the Dynasty, D.C. Dillinger and Brian Fury, team with Chase Del Monte to take on the new NECW heavyweight champion, the infamous Bobby Fish, Matt Taven, and former ECW and WWE star Nunzio. The World Women's Wrestling Championship will be on the line as Alexis Nevaeh defends the title against Barbie. In a battle of former tag team champions, the Hoods take on the crown jewels. The real deal Brandon Locke battles Taka Suzuki. In a return grudge match, the butcher John Poe squares off against Apocalypse. Plus, Sean Burke in action and more. All tickets for this event are just $10 and are on sale now at Carver High School. Giorgio's Pizza, 105 Main Street in Carver, online at NECWWrestling.com or call toll-free 1-800-838-3006. That's 1-800-838-3006. Don't miss NECW Live when it comes to Carver High School, Saturday night, December 10th, 7 p.m. in Carver. Brandon, Brandon, what was said between you and the Dynasty in the locker room after your match tonight? What was said between us is going to stay between us. 
Okay, well, what's going on in your head right now? I mean, first you lose the NECW Heavyweight Championship, and now you seem to be on the outs with your, your newfound friends. First off, the title loss was on me. It was only on me and nobody else. I'll take blame for that. And these friends you speak of, I really wouldn't consider them friends. Okay, well, then what's next for Brandon Locke here in New England Championship Wrestling? <clears throat> what's next? Well, I got a lot of stuff in my mind, so I'll just, just leave it at that.